Please be seated, le Président. Reprise de débat. The court is now back in session. I hand over to the prosecution to continue his line of questioning. You may proceed. La parole est maintenant à l'accusation. Thank you, Mr. President. Le procureur. Merci, Monsieur le Président. And just for scheduling purposes to assist all counsel, um, I wish to indicate this. Parties, we anticipate we will end our examination dire que nous nous à today. Notre interrogatoire um, and we will hand the floor over with your leave parole, uh, to civil parties si um, at, at some point today, most likely after lunch. Sans doute après la pause and uh, I believe civil parties will take approximately half a day. Les parties civiles um, auront demi journée. Give or take half an hour. Environ, and at that point, enfin, we will be in a position to hand over to the defence. Et donc, il, uh, la défense so pourrait ensuite avoir la parole. Je le dis maintenant time. pour que la chambre puisse préparer le temps de parole. Good morning again, Mr. Sakim Almut. Monsieur Sakim Almut. I'd like to move on to another topic. You will recall un autre sujet. on Thursday, the 31st of May, que le 31 mai, jeudi dernier, we looked at a number of documents which um, un certain nombre de documents. recorded uh, the exportation of produce from the Democratic Cambodia, de l'exportation de produits, or at least they referred to the exportation des documents qui faisaient of produce. À and de différents produits, I asked you denrées. if you recalled uh, the amounts involved, uh, you said that um, si you couldn't recall longtemps. off the top of your vous head, dit ne pas vous um, but you said to me that des quantités, if I am able to show you vous dit toutefois some documents si je pouvais vous on that topic, sujet, that you may be able to clarify or assist further. Vous um, permettrez de nous aider. Mr. President, I'd like to show the witness a number of documents and see if indeed he can assist. Pour voir peut en effet nous aider. The first document le premier is D366-7-7. And I should state now that uh, it, it is not discussed, dirai, as far as we can tell, with the witness in his interviews, uh, but it is a Ministry of, of Commerce record, and uh, we'd like to show it to him commerce. and see if he's able to uh, assist us Mais with it in any way. So with your permission, I'll give the witness a copy. Donc j'aimerais que l'on remette une, un exemplaire du document au témoin. The President. You may proceed. First, the court officer is instructed to obtain the document from the prosecution and present it to the witness. Mr. Lamut, if you could take a look at that document. Monsieur Lamut. And -vous tell us if uh, you have seen it before or if you have seen si similar vu, records. Si vous avez vu des For the transcript, this is a report from Paddy Rice between the 1st and 7th of March 1977. It's issued by the Ministry of Commerce. Par le Ministère du Commerce. Response. Mr. President, I have Monsieur never Président, seen this report before. Je jamais vu ce have you seen a table similar to it as part of your déjà vu des activities de in recording uh, ledgers, as you, as you explained to us last week? De, de have you seen similar documents? 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 Have you seen similar Response. 
I have seen other documents, but none was déjà vu identical to mais aucun this, uh, this kind of document. The president court officer is now instructed to remove the document from document. the witness. Very well, Mr. Lamout. Um, We'll try another document um, see to see if uh, you're able to assist us with it. Uh, Your Honours, this is D161 1.32. It is a, a letter to the Embassy of Yugoslavia and it deals with a shipment of of certain commodities. De de uh, and with your permission, I'd like to show the witness the Khmer version of that document. D161 slash 1.32. You may proceed. Le President. But oui. the court officer, please uh, take the document from the prosecution and give it to the witness first. Mr. Lamut, do you recall seeing this document no. or documents similar to it? Monsieur Lamut, vous souvenez-vous d'avoir vu un tel document ou un document In your work at the commercial bank. Dans le cadre de votre euh, travail à la banque du commerce. Response. Mr. President, neither have Monsieur I seen this document before. Le président, je n'ai jamais vu ce document. Very well, um, Mr. President, I, I would like to try another document and see if uh, if, if, if the witness has, is familiar with it. And, and this would be uh, IS eighteen point twenty four. Il s'agit plutôt du document IS dix-huit point vingt-quatre. The President, you may proceed. But, court officer, please obtain a document from the prosecution and present it to the witness. While at the same time, you should remove the document uh, from the witness, the, uh, the preceding document. Is this uh, a document you're familiar with, Mr. Lamotte? Le procureur. Reconnaissez-vous ce document, Monsieur le témoin? Response. Mr. President, neither have I seen this document before. Jamais vu ce document. Take the document back veuille from the witness that is the document IS 18.24. C'est à dire le document IS 18.24. Prosecution, le président you should select documents as your basis which are certain that the witness has vous seen such documents for vous êtes your opinion que to this witness, déjà vu. so that you do not waste your time allocated to, to you. And you temps. just pick a document at random si vous un document au hasard et que without vous thinking of its relevancy to this witness. It's going to be a time waste. <coughs> Thank you, Mr. President. We were just uh, what we were doing is seeking to elicit uh, from the witness whether he's seen these, whether he is familiar with them, given that he has uh, testified that he's seen a number of uh, prepared ledgers relating to export. Uh, we'll move on to another another topic.
qu'aux exportations. Mais je vais passer à un autre point. Mr. Lemout, uh, Monsieur Lemout, are you familiar with an individual called Koi Thun? Do you know who that un certain Koi is? Thun. Mr. President, I do not know Monsieur this person. Je ne connais pas cette personne. Very well. Um, L'accusation. Très bien. Now, if we return to a document Revenons that we discussed at the last hearing on the 31st of May. This was one of the documents that were shown to you by the co-investigating judges. Um, and I, I note that you indicated that you didn't take part in the meetings. Um, but you, you, you recognize some of the people that are named in, in the document. Your Honours, this is a minute uh, of the decisions of the Standing Committee dated 19th to the 21st of April 1976. It, was, uh, it bears the number E3 slash 235, and it was shown to the witness in his second interview, and at that point it was assigned the number D279-7.1, and Your Honours will recall that um, in one section of the document there is a reference to the witness. Uh, I'd like to show it to him with your permission. President, yes, you may do so. First, the court officer, could you take the document from the prosecution for the witness to view? Mr. Lamont, if you recall, this is one of the documents we discussed, and as I said, uh, we know that you didn't take part in this meeting. Um, do you recall our discussion about this document last week? Do you recall that we had discussed this document last week? Yes, I Thank you. If, if we could uh, show the document on the screen, Your Honours, uh, we just wish to project the first page of the document. La première page. President, President, yes, you may do so. Assistant and the relevant section, could you please assist with the projection of the document, document on the screen? If we could have that on the screen. L'accusation. Pouvons-nous afficher cela à l'écran? Wonder if there might be a technical issue. Uh, we we have it ready, but. Uh, y a-t-il un problème technique? Wonder if there's a technical issue with the AV unit. Est prêt, mais apparemment, il y a un problème technique du côté des services audiovisuels. Thank you. Merci. We've discussed the uh, the Commerce Committee uh, extensively, Mr. Lamont, uh, and I just wish to um, 
discuss with you briefly the, the composition um, at the top of the of the committee. Um, if we scroll down under number one, there is a, a listing of the members of the Commerce Committee. Now, just to read in, in that section in full for the record, under number one, uh, preparation preparations to organize various committees surrounding Office 870. And then under number one on the left-hand side, we see Comrade Rith, with, with whom we've uh, become familiar. We also see Comrades Nem and Chuan. Mr. Lamut, do you recall Comrade Chuan, do you know who he was? Que vous vous souvenez du camarade Chuan? Savez-vous qui c'était? Response. Réponse. No, I do not know no. this person amongst the three. I only know one personne. person that is Comrade Ret. Parmi ces trois personnes, je connais simplement le camarade Ret. If we uh, question. Just move forward in that same document uh, to a section we were looking at last week, and it starts with the Roman numeral 4. If, if the AV unit could show that on the screen, just want to see if this refreshes your memory in any way. And the Roman numeral 4, and if the AV unit could show that, I will take us to the relevant portion. Je vais épingler les it should be pertinents. at the bottom of page 5 and top of page 6 in the, in the en document we're looking at. Um, we, we did spécial. look at this, this um, Nous avons déjà uh, section last time, Mr. Lamut. Lamut. Under number 2, regarding Sous the Chinese commercial delegation, de la délégation uh, there is a decision here to organize a delegation a to receive and negotiate. And it includes Comrade Dorn, who you discussed, Dunn, Comrade Crin, parlé, another Comrade individual Crin, that you've uh, described as the head of the Ports Committee, que vous avez comme étant Comrade Say, and then Comrade Chuan. And of course, at the end of that list is sûr, also fin, your name. Il y a aussi votre nom. Does that refresh your memory? Que cela vous la Were you appointed to a to a delegation with this individual, Comrade Chuan, from the Commerce Committee. Response. Yes, I recall, but I oui, cannot recall the date. Mais je ne me souviens pas de la date. I recall that at that time, Je me souviens à ce moment -là, Dune was the head Dune of the delegation. Était chef de délégation. Do you Question. recall what happened to Vous Comrade Chung? Rappelez-vous. Ce qui est arrivé After that appointment, Chun, après qu'il eut été nommé à ce poste. Response. Réponse. No, I did not know what happened non, to him. J'ignore ce qui lui est arrivé. Uh, very well, I'll just indicate for the record. Question. Très bien. That, uh, Je signalerai juste. His S21 enfin, confession is IS5.104. A passé des aveux à Mr. Lamout, uh, if we come IS back one step, um, in that committee, Revenons on that first page, uh, we read was Comrade Rith, Comrade Nem, and Comrade Chuan. Et Chuan. Do you recall Comrade Nem? Vous did you work with him? Or did you meet him during the TK period? Est-ce que vous avez travaillé avec lui? Est-ce que vous l'avez rencontré durant la période du Cambodge démocratique? Response. Réponse. Neither Nem nor Chun. 
I worked with je ne me souviens ni de Niem ni de Chun. J'ai simplement travaillé avec le camarade so Rutt. I did not have any contact with the Je n'ai eu aucun contact avec les deux autres personnes en Thank question. Thank you, and before we leave, uh, comrade Merci. Nem, Avant I'll just indicate that he is listed de in the S21 chose, list, je uh, que Niem which is document D288-6. Point sixty eight point one at ERN à l'entrée dix mille sept cent quatre vingt un. Il s'agit d'une liste de prisonniers de S vingt et Mr. Lamout, we saw Monsieur Lamout from the passage that you discussed with The investigators, Avec or rather the, the passage from your witness interview, uh, which related to the uh, removal or disappearance of de votre Vaughan Vett, um, you said that in that interview that you did not dare Vett, ask what happened to him. Avez dit ne pas avoir osé ce lui était Were you aware at, at this time of other? Disappearances. À ce Were there any other disappearances of people you worked with or people you knew within the Ministry of Commerce? De disparition d'autres personnes que vous connaissiez au ministère du Commerce. Response. Response. I cannot recall clearly. Je ne me souviens pas bien. Besides, there was a one staffer. Who was an interpreter Il y avait un membre du personnel qui était interprète au ministère du Commerce. Post, Il a été retiré de son poste, mais je ne sais pas ce qui lui est arrivé. And Question. How did you feel at the time? À l'époque, que ressentiez-vous vous, vous avez maintenant confirmé que vous saviez qu'au moins deux disparitions avaient eu lieu. Comment est-ce que vous vous êtes senti Response. Réponse. I was concerned and worried. J'étais inquiet. Because at the commerce section, one individual was dans la section du commerce, une personne avait été so retirée. I did have a personal concern for myself. J'étais donc inquiet pour ma propre personne. Do you know who he was Question. removed by? Savez-vous par qui cette personne a été retirée Réponse. Non. Question. Avez-vous jamais Disappearances with de ces disparitions Van Rith, who you said you were close to Van Rith, dont vous étiez proche à l'époque, d'après ce que vous dites. Response. Réponse. Let me clarify. Van Rith was not the chief Van at, at the foreign commerce section. N'était pas le chef de la section du commerce extérieur. Je n'ai pas parlé de quelques disparitions que ce soit avec lui, bien entendu. You said you were personally concerned and worried vous dites que vous aviez des inquiétudes pour votre propre personne après la disparition de l'un de vos collègues. Avez-vous Did you have discussions with any of them Observer about la façon this issue? dont les autres se sentaient, est-ce que vous avez pu en discuter avec eux Réponse. No, uh, did not non. discuss this issue with anybody. Je n'en ai parlé à personne.
I'd like to show you l'accusation. A document, Je voudrais Mr. Lamont. vous présenter un document, Monsieur Lamont, able to assist us with it. pour voir si vous pouvez nous aider. This is a, a decision C'est une décision uh, by the Ministry of Commerce. It's du ministère dated du Commerce the 17th en date du 17 octobre 1976. Your Honours, the document number la cote is D108 D108 slash 26 26 dot 27.27 And with your permission I'd like to show the hard copy to the witness first. Je voudrais d'abord faire remettre un exemplaire papier du document au témoin si la chambre m'y autorise. Uh, Le président Jess, you may proceed. Vous y êtes autorisé. Oui, si l'audience. Veuillez aller remettre ce document to the witness au témoin. For his view. And just while the witness is reading, uh, for the record, I'll indicate the, lit, the title of the document is the Ministry of Commerce document, un document du du Committee of the Ministry of Commerce, du du Commerce after asking for opinions from the sections in the ministry, decides to arrest and send the following persons to security to interrogate for information. Mr. Lamout, Have you seen this document before? Monsieur Lamont, avez-vous vu or documents similar to document? it? Il y a des documents analogues. Response. Mr. President, I have never seen Monsieur this Président, document or a similar document. Je n'ai jamais to this vu one. ni ce document ni le document Analogue. President, court officer, could Le you remove the document from the witness? Veuillez retirer ce document. I will just show you l'accusation. Another one Je more document only. Vous montrer uh, on this, un seul on autre this autre topic, document. it is slightly different. Sur ce point, um, c'est un document. I'm wondering if you might be able to. Différent. Peut-être. Assist us if you recognize the document. Uh, Your Honours, this is D366-7.27.27. Uh, and it is dated the 17th of October 1976. With your permission, we'll show it to the witness and see if he's uh, familiar with it. Je demanderai à présenter ce document au témoin pour voir si celui-ci le you. connaît. Le President, président de la Chambre vous y autorise. Monsieur d'audience, veuillez remettre ce document au témoin. Comme je l'ai fait pour le document précédent, je vais After lire consulting with le début. All the sections, Après consultation de toutes of the les sections, Commerce le comité du ministère du Commerce décide the the d'envoyer les personnes suivantes au centre de rééducation de la sécurité. Document, Est-ce que vous connaissez ce document, M. Lamont Réponse. Mr. President, Monsieur le Président, I have never seen je n'ai jamais vu ce document to this. ni de documents similaires. President, court officer, le Président, could you remove that document from the witness? veuillez aller récupérer ce document. The prosecution that you are again reminded je rappelle à l'accusation to be clear on the documents qu'il convient to be presented to the witness and be certain that the document document. the witness has seen or read the documents. Il faut s'assurer don't just que le pick and choose a document for a déjà him été to, vu to par le examine. Témoin. On ne and peut choisir secondly, des documents au hasard pour les remettre au témoin. Deuxième chose, le présent témoin ne travaillait pas au ministère du Commerce, mais bien à la banque. So please don't waste the time 
If you run out of questions, de you should con temps. conclude your si vous question plus de questions, and don't just try to fill in the gaps of the allocated time with repetitive questions or by presenting irrele irrelevant documents to the witness. Ou en présentant aux témoins des documents I hope the de prosecution make use of the time available L'accusation devrait utiliser au mieux le temps de parole qui lui a été imparti et procéder à son interrogatoire de manière plus efficace. Thank you, Mr. President. I just want to note for the record that Merci, Monsieur le Président. we have no way of knowing what documents the witness has seen nous ne pouvons pas savoir other than those attached to his interview. He worked at the ministry or at the bank for three years at least. Car vu le témoin à part soit attaché à ses pédodiciaux, il a travaillé à la banque au moins trois ans. Mr. Lamout. Et la banque était attachée au comité du commerce. You worked with, Monsieur uh, Lamout, Van Rith. vous avez travaillé avec Van Rith. And as we saw, you attended Comme on l'a vu, with him, vous avez assisté à des réunions en sa compagnie avec des délégations étrangères. You have not seen these documents that vous I just showed you. Pas vu les documents but if I ask you a question based on the documents, si je vous pose une question fondée sur les documents, est-ce que vous avez eu connaissance de décisions prises par le ministère consistant à envoyer des gens à la sécurité. Non, je n'ai jamais eu connaissance de cela. Je n'ai jamais non plus participé à des réunions où il aurait été décidé d'envoyer quelqu'un à la sécurité. And related cela relevait to du my ministère section. du commerce, cela n'avait rien à voir avec ma propre section. Je ne connaissais même pas Although ces gens. Another, Nous travaillions les uns à côté des autres, mais ça c'était leurs affaires. So I did not, uh, with their Et je ne mêlais pas business. de leurs activités. And that is also my Thank you. C'était... Um, We will leave that uh, topic. I think you've told us everything that you nous allons en rester là. Je pense que vous avez dit tout ce dont vous pouviez with vous souvenir um, et que vous étiez prêt à nous présenter. I will move on to um, another Je vais passer theme. À I just wish un autre to point. ensure that we have a full understanding Je voudrais veiller à ce que nous comprenions positions you held and, and roles quelles étaient les fonctions you performed, um, que vous exerciez et les tâches que vous effectuiez durant la période allant de 1979, la semaine passée, that you were vous avez confirmé que vous aviez été directeur adjoint de la Banque du Commerce du Cambodge. When did you assume that position? À quel moment avez-vous assumé ces fonctions C'était immédiatement après votre retour à Phnom Penh en 1976 ou bien à un autre moment Réponse. Regarding that bank, that bank was not in a, a similar form of the current bank. Cette because banque at that time there was ne ressemblait pas currency. aux banques d'aujourd'hui, car à l'époque il n'y avait pas de monnaie. On appelait ça la banque du commerce extérieur. Sa tâche principale portait sur les achats et les ventes. And it was not a national bank like Avec the bank we know these days. Les pays étrangers, ce n'était pas une banque comme celle d'aujourd'hui. When I was uh, transferred from the cooperative, quand j'ai été transféré de la coopérative, there was uh, no establishment of the bank yet. La banque n'avait pas encore été mise en place. The, the decisions by the ce n'est qu'après la décision prise in order to par form le comité a deal with the que la banque with a été établie pour les transactions commerciales And avec les pays étrangers. Au début, la décision de créer cette banque n'existait que sur papier. And I personally was not aware of how much money the bank je held. je ne savais pas combien And There was the de liquidité était en possession the the bank. de la banque. Celle-ci avait un directeur général, c'était un certain May, si mes souvenirs sont bons. 
And then uh, for myself, pour ma part, I was uh, titled as the deputy director. Mon titre était and I celui de directeur adjoint. Mais I je n'ai jamais rencontré le directeur he, général. He looked like. Je ne savais même pas à quoi il ressemblait. And I actually asked a gentleman there what was my job in that bank. J'ai demandé à quelqu'un en quoi consistaient mes fonctions dans la banque. Because it was only formed in that sense. That is all. Parce qu'elle venait juste d'être créée. Haven't quite fully answered my question. L'accusation. Vous n'avez pas pleinement répondu à ma question. At what stage? What? What date? À quel moment? Approximately or precisely, if you recall, was that appointment made? When were you appointed the deputy director? Mr. Chairman, 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 Mr. Chairman
from 8 a.m. until 10 a.m. Nous rendre compte frère de notre rencontre avec nos camarades coréens au ministère du Commerce le 5 octobre 78 de 8h à 10h du Ensuite, composition de l'équipe cambodienne. Camarades Lemout, Pan et Suan. Mr. Lemout, do you recognize this document and do you recall attending that meeting? Mais vous souvenez-vous d'avoir participé à cette réunion? Uh, response. I cannot recall it clearly. And in addition, I have never seen this document either. Looking at the substance, there was the attendance of Le Mut Pon and Soon. And to my recollection, Soon was a small level officer of the uh, Commerce Committee. And Pon was an advisor and also the uh, third secretary of the uh, Commerce Committee. So he was a person of lower rank as well. So by looking at these uh, individuals, I uh, could comment that they were in lower level uh, positions, uh, but I do not uh, yet know the substance of this document unless I am given time to go through this document. But to my recollection, I have never been the chair uh, person of any meeting with foreign delegation. Uh, and if there were uh, such meeting was of a low profile meeting. Thank you. Um, de faible importance. Mr. President, um, Le Président. I'm in your hands, but consistent oui, with the Chamber's rulings Monsieur of last Président, week, um, vous, we submit it would be appropriate to show the document on the screen. Conformément um, à la décision rendue par la Chambre la semaine dernière, the witness is attending and the, the witness doesn't deny montrer, uh, attending the meeting. Car le témoin, enfin le document rapporte que le témoin a participé à une rencontre, ce que le the témoin ne nie pas. You may proceed. Le président, allez-y. Thank you. We will just display the first Merci. page. Nous pouvons en afficher la première page. Mr. Lamout, uh, Monsieur Lamout, we're not. Um, interested uh, necessarily in the detailed contents of the discussions. Um, we're just, I'm really only wanting to understand the, your relationship with the Ministry of Commerce and your uh, role in, in these meetings. meetings. The first paragraph I will read, quote, before commencing trade talks, we informed Comrade Korea, after exchanging an introductory expression, that as Comrade Van Rith was on a mission outside Phnom Penh, three of us have been assigned to greet and discuss trade issues with Comrade Korea today. That passage indicates that, essentially, you were assigned to attend this meeting in place of Comrade Van Rith. Do you recall being assigned to attend meetings with foreign delegations? Is that an accurate summary of your assignment for that meeting? Response. I cannot recall it clearly, but I do not deny that I was attending this meeting either, because I am not sure, because uh, at that time probably uh, Mr. Van Rett was on mission, and um, Pon, Suen, and I who were in the Ministry of Commerce, and then we met uh, with the Commerce, Secretary of the 
Korean nous counterpart. Le troisième secrétaire de And as for the format of this report, I cannot recall whether or not uh, this was instructed by us or somebody else. Je ne sais pas si Do you recall who it was that assigned you to nous attend instructions instructions de this meeting in place of Van Rijt? Question. Vous souvenez-vous d'avoir été affecté à une rencontre à la place de Van Rijt? Response. I cannot recall it. I would like to ask uh, for leave from the chamber to go through this document, particularly the uh, letter part of this document. Mr. President, we have no objection if the witness wishes to see the rest of the document. We have no objection if the witness wishes to see the rest of Response. After going through this document, the Korean counterparts uh, suggested that uh, they uh, wanted uh, to purchase some goods from Cambodia. But I think uh, in that meeting, somebody else was the chairperson. If I was the chair of that meeting, then uh, my writing style would uh, be different from this. But there must have been somebody else above me in that meeting. And to be honest, by looking at this paper briefly, I cannot uh, comment in detail because uh, this event took place long time ago. Plus de précision, car ces événements remontent il y a assez longtemps. And I do not want to assume or speculate on this matter or that matter by reading it uh, briefly like this. But the writing style and the format itself uh, did not uh, belong to my format. So somebody else must have written it. The President, le co prosecutor may continue your line of questioning. Vous pouvez poursuivre avec cette série de questions. You say that um, it appears question. someone else chaired the meeting. Vous dites Do you agree with me que that you are listed as the first and most senior Mais member of the Cambodian delegation pour dire there on the first page? Sur la première page, cité comme Just le premier de l'équipe et celui occupant le rang le plus élevé. Response. I am not sure because in this document it indicated that on the Cambodian side 
there were the mud pond and soon, and there was no indication as to who uh, chaired the Cambodian side. And this report involves the purchase and selling of rubber, which was a different matter. And there were other matters that might have been dealt with by uh, Pon and Sun. Peut-être d'autres questions qui avaient été traitées par Pan et Sun. I think there might have been such meeting, but uh, I am not sure if uh, I was the chairman of the meeting at that time. Si the président. president intervenes. Uh, prosecutor, you may continue your question. Monsieur le procureur, vous pouvez poursuivre avec vos questions. Thank you, Mr. President. Merci, Monsieur le Président. Mr. Lamut, would you agree with me that Monsieur Lamut. your assignment to be at this meeting, apparently in a senior capacity, pour dire que votre à cette réunion, indicates that en qualité de responsable, you had a position of considerable responsibility vous un poste in relation to the Ministry of Commerce. Des responsabilités au sein du ministère du Commerce. The President, the witness, please uh, hold on. The National Defense Council for Kilsimpon, you may proceed. Council. Thank you, Mr. President. I would like to object against this document on the basis that the question is repetitive. And the witness has already stated very clearly several times uh, that uh, he was of lower rank. The President, the objection by the Defense Council for Q some point is sustained because the question is repetitive and the witness uh, need not answer the question. Having looked at this document, Mr. Lamont, how would you describe your knowledge of the Ministry of Com Commerce Après avoir lu work? Ce document, Monsieur le Were you very knowledgeable about its work, façon dont fonctionnait le or ministère? is otherwise true? Connaissiez-vous bien le fonctionnement du ministère? Response. Response. Aside from what I have testified, the task under the supervision of the Commerce Committee was different from my designated task. When I look through this document, uh, I was a bit curious of this document. I cannot say that it was not uh, the one I was involved, but I am not just sure, sure of it because uh, the writing style and the format was not familiar to me. But I cannot be precise on this uh, document because there was uh, events of our dialogues with the Korean counterpart on purchasing and selling certain stuff. And, and at that time, of course, uh, there were other 
comrades as well, and the two comrades mentioned in this document were from the Commerce Committee, but there was no designation as to who chaired the Cambodian delegation. And as for the authority to decide whether to sell or purchase any goods from the Korean counterpart was not mentioned in this document either. And in addition, uh, there was no indication as to who uh, prepared uh, or authored uh, this report. Thank you, Mr. Lamotte. I think your uh, response is comprehensive. This meeting, of course, Cette took rencontre. place, as the document indicates, on the, document, 5th of October, the 5th of October 1978. 1978. And it's a matter, matter of public record that on the 6th of January 1979, the, regime, the Democratic regime fell. Uh, Where did you go? At that point, what did you do on the 6th or 7th of January? Did you stay in Phnom Penh or did you go to Phnom Penh? Where did you go? Where did you go? Did you stay in Phnom Penh or did you go elsewhere? Response. I remained in Phnom Penh until the last day of the regime, and when the democratic Cambodia fell. I took a refuge uh, along with others. Du and je suis allé after that, uh, comme les escape from Phnom Penh, Question. did you après, continue to work with people who had, who had been members of the Democratic Kampuchea regime? And if you did, did you hold any position in particular? Occupiez-vous une position quelconque? Response. Mr. President, Monsieur I think the, the Democratic Cambodia regime uh, ended on the 6th of January 1979, uh, and uh, I don't know if I should respond to the question concerning my involvement after that period. The President, uh, witness me not answer the question because the question is Irrelevant. Le témoin n'a pas à répondre à la question. Elle est dénuée de pertinence. Mr. President, the purpose. Le procureur. I note and respect the decision. Um, I'll just indicate the purpose of asking that question. Décision, was to la raison pour laquelle je l'ai posé. Elicit other evidence on the witnesses' uh, associations with senior people in Democratic Cambodia. Um, just before. I end my examination so that the record is not incomplete. I will not ask the witness about this. I will not ask the witness about this. Document E3 slash 1435, which is dated the 18th of December 1979, uh, refers to the witness and the function he held. Um, the relevant ERNs are in English. S Triple zero one seven nine eight eight. Dix-sept quatre-vingt-dix-huit. Khmer ERN. Huit. Double zero. Khmer ERN. Khmer. Five nine five two seven four. And French ERN. Double zero. Five nine seven eight two zero. Donc en Khmer zéro zéro cinquante-neuf quarante-deux cinquante-neuf cinquante-quatorze et en français zéro zéro cinquante-neuf soixante-dix-huit. Held the position of Secretary of State for Supply and Transportation. Et cela est un document du Cambodge démocratique. Your Honours, que le témoin était secrétaire d'État à l'approvisionnement et au transport. We have no further questions for this witness. Nous n'avons plus de questions pour ce témoin. Thank you for coming here to answer these questions and assist the court in finding the truth. Merci beaucoup d'être venu aider la Chambre à découvrir la vérité et à répondre à nos questions. Je n'ai pas d'autres questions pour vous aujourd'hui. Merci.
the president. The civil party lead co-lawyers and the delegated uh, civil party lawyers. Can you indicate as to how much time you will need to question the witness? Oui, Monsieur le Président. Bonjour, bonjour, Madame, Good morning, Mesdames et Messieurs Mr. les juges. Je Good pense morning, que pour la partie civile, euh, aux alentours de deux heures, c'est-à-dire euh, en fait l'après-midi, nous suffirait pour hours, poser nos questions. Which means that, um, Merci. The afternoon would suffice for our examination of the witness. Thank you. Bah, le Président. Le Président. Thank you, uh, lead co-lawyers, uh, for the indication of uh, the times. And the time is now appropriate for lunch at German. The chamber will resume at 1.30 this afternoon. Court officer is instructed to uh, coordinate uh, the place for the witness and his duty counsel to rest and bring them back to this courtroom by 1.30 this afternoon. Counsel, you may proceed. Mr. President, uh, my client uh, Nguyen Chia would like to attend uh, the hearing this afternoon from his holding cell for the usual reasons, and we have the waiver to submit to you straight away. The President, having noted the request by Nguyen Chia through his defense counsel to waive his right to be present directly in this courtroom, but instead follow the proceeding from the holding self through audiovisual means from the holding, holding cell, and his defense Council have indicated that the letter of waiver is ready for submission to the chamber. So the request is granted. Mr. Nguyen Chia may follow the proceedings from a holding cell downstairs through audiovisual equipment for the remainder of the proceedings today. And he has expressly waived his right to be Nguyen present Chia directly in the courtroom. And the defense team for Nguyen Chia is required to submit the chamber immediately the letter of waiver not to be present in this courtroom with the uh, signature or some print of the accused Nguyen Chia. An AV officer is instructed to link the audiovisual means uh, to the holding cell downstairs for the remainder of the proceeding this afternoon. Security guards are instructed to bring Mr. Nguyen Chia and Kiel Simpon to the holding cell downstairs. This afternoon, Mr. Nguyen Chia will remain in the holding cell downstairs to follow the proceeding by remote means uh, from his holding cell. And audiovisual equipment will be ready for him to follow the proceeding as such. And Whereas Mr. Kilson Pond is to be brought to this courtroom before 1.30, the court is now adjourned.